Hello and welcome to this video on applying for permanent residency through the National Interest Waiver. If you're a highly skilled professional in a field that is of national interest to the United States, then you may be eligible for a green card through this special category. The National Interest Waiver falls under the Employment-Based Second Preference category, which is reserved for professionals with advanced degrees or exceptional ability in the sciences, arts, or business. The NEU allows applicants to bypass the traditional labor certification process and apply directly for a green card. The first step in applying for the NEU is to gather all the necessary documentation to demonstrate your exceptional ability in your field. This may include evidence of your education, work experience, publications, awards, and any other contributions you've made to your field. Once you have all your documentation in order, you'll need to fill out Form I-140, which is the petition for alien worker. This form will require you to provide information about your education, work experience, and other qualifications, as well as the nature of your work and how it is of national interest. In addition to Form I-140, you'll also need to submit a detailed letter explaining how your work is of national interest and why you should be granted a waiver of the traditional labor certification process. This letter should provide specific examples of how your work has contributed to your field and how it will benefit the United States. Form I-140, Immigrant Petition for Alien Worker, is the first step to obtaining an employment-based green card. Approval of your Form I-140 means you will be eligible for permanent residency. Your I-140 approval will specify which type of employment-based category you both applied and are eligible for. Form I-485, Application to Register Permanent Residence or Adjust Status, is used by a person in the United States to apply for lawful permanent resident status. The approval of the I-485 means that the beneficiary has been approved for the permanent resident card. The card will be received a few weeks after the final interview date, depending on the officer's decision to communicate with the USS to produce the card. Once you've completed your application, it's important to submit it to the appropriate USS service center along with the filing fee and any supporting documentation. You'll then need to wait for a decision from USS on your application. If your application is approved, you'll be granted a green card and will be able to live and work in the United States permanently. It's important to note that the NEU is a highly selective category, and USIS will only approve applications that meet their strict criteria. Thank you for watching this video on applying for permanent residency through the National Interest Waiver. If you have any questions or would like more information, be sure to consult with an experienced immigration attorney or visit the USIS website. Good luck with your application. Thanks for watching. Like, comment and subscribe. Biomeditech Jobs and Career